Hello everyone, my name is Jill Mizinski, and my Blue Marble YSP project was the SALAD project. So what is the SALAD project? It's an acronym that stands for Space Agriculture Laboratory Analysis Database. What it actually does is consolidate all papers and experiments concerning space plants into one easy to use and accessible platform. Its purpose is to not only assist scientists in researching what we know already, but also to open the public's eyes to the gaps in our research. Our goal is to further the hopeful field of space agriculture. We are also working on the Space Crop Wiki, which is another form of consolidated information for both earthbound space plant enthusiasts and astronauts alike. So what am I doing? A lot of my work focuses on data visualization, especially the data meant for the Space Crop Wiki. You can see my work on our website. This is a diagram showing the relationship between all of our data points, including papers, crops, spacecraft, and more. You can play with this yourself on saladproject.org. Once the Space Crop Wiki goes live, you'll also be able to see my work there. I'm using a website called Kumu, which has our current data set loaded into it. With this software, I'm able to visualize certain relationships between our data points, as well as gaps within the data, hopefully expressing to potential researchers the need for more experiments in this field. What I'm focusing on currently is the timeline of all romaine lettuce that has been grown in space. This is a proof of concept for future work to be done for each crop in our database. Included here are the first crops to be entirely grown and eaten in space, over here, as well as some extremely important experiments that pioneered the veggie growth chamber on the ISS. Additionally, everyone on the team is working to input papers and experiments into the database. It isn't as glamorous as some of my charts, but it's the heart and soul of the operation. I've also had a hand in the formatting of the database to hopefully make it more accessible to the public. So what other impact have we had? Growing Beyond Earth, or GBE, is a citizen science project partnered with NASA. It sends growth chambers that mimic those on the International Space Station to schools around the nation. These students run experiments to gather information on potential crops to be grown in space. GBE is using our software to host experimental data from their experiments. Finally, I helped to design and refine the SALAD project scientific poster. You can see my work in the center here with this diagram displaying all of our information. This eventually won first place at the American Society for Horticultural Science Conference. So what's to come after this? In the future, I plan to continue working with this project even after my time at Blue Marble Space is complete, because I have greatly appreciated my time with my mentors and co-workers and have learned much under their guidance. Thank you very much for watching.